Uh, thank you very much, uh, dear farmers. Today I'm in Chiruhula and I'm very happy about the activity we are, we are taking. I, as I always appreciate our viewers, uh, those from Nigeria, from Ghana, uh, from wherever in Africa. We really appreciate and we like your comments. I get your comments on WhatsApp, uh, those who give me calls, those in UK. We are so happy about <coughs> Excuse me, what is happening and that you follow up and really look at the work we do and you appreciate. So what we are going to do here, we are doing, um, we are going to do embryo transfer, but now we are preparing the, the animals. We have been um, uh, uh, doing PD or pregnancy diagnosis testing to see those that are pregnant so that you don't have them. So here they are going to uh, they injected them with hormones and the process will take uh, at least uh, some days and then but what we are trying to do is uh, trying to improve uh, the genetics as you see i always tell you that if you are to deal and be a livestock a farmer who is happy and performing well you must do have the three pillars that is genetics that is nutrition and the management. So um, on the road to improve genetics, embryo transfer is one of those uh, techniques that are very, very important uh, that will do a very, very good job for us. So today we are in Chilhura. We are going to, to work on around the 30 animals um, and we have other farms that we are going to work on. So. This is a very important activity that is happening and its importance is improve uh, production. And here we are specifically looking at uh, the genes, all those embryos that are going to do much better uh, from uh, the American side. We are looking at the high, high, high miracles. So you see we have lined them up here. You can Line them up here. So they are being uh, worked on. Those we are using. All these are papers. Uh, this farm has done really good work as far as the military uh, time. But we are doing more, more, much, we are doing much more, uh, much more work. So the person who is behind the the work of embryo transfer it is not a very common technology in Uganda, but we are saying we are going to do some good work with a very useful gentlemen who are doing uh, good work. So this is Dr. Kasule, and I want him to uh, clearly explain what is happening and what is doing here, because we really appreciate the work he's doing. So Dr. Take us through. What is happening here? Yeah, thank you, Brian, and uh, thank you, viewers, for watching us. So today, we are in the process of uh, synchronization, the process which is supposed to take us 18 days. And in that process, we are using a protocol where we use uh, a progesterone derivative, which is a suppository. We use uh, a prostaglandin for alpha, and then estradiol benzoate to synchronize these animals. So what happens is that we, when we inject with the with the estradiol benzoate and the, and the, and these other hormones, we synchronize them. We bring them into cycling all together, so that at the at the end, when we come to do embryo transfer, we shall be able to transfer the embryos all at once instead of coming at the farm uh, in, on different days. Like I said, we are trying to improve genetics and we are using the Jersey breed, which is one of our flagship breeds uh, in Naro and in the country. So with, the, with that technology, we shall be able to bring pure Jersey genetics onto this farm using these animals as the surrogates. Thank you. Yeah, I, I can see he has been using some hard tongues. Uh, but yeah, as we as we move along, we are going to um, we are going to get used. It is, it is just something very very interesting. So we appreciate uh, 
uh, the Lalo team are those that are really bringing in the technologies. And for us, our work is to make sure that we get uh, those kind of uh, technologies and bring to uh, you farmers out there. So thank you very much for um, always watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let us improve the livestock sector. Let us improve the dairy. Let us improve the beef. As I said, I'm going to make to walk this journey together with you to make sure that we all get success. And if we get something new, why not share it with people? Why not share that technology with others so that many people can benefit? When the herd, the national herd is being improved, we are all uh, benefiting. Thank you so much. So we have given the animals the two shots of, uh, of uh, progesterone and the uh, prostaglandin to alpha. Now it is time to insert this repository. It is a one gram implant. This particular one is from Syntex. And we, we insert it into the first canal. So what happens is that we get uh, the suppository from the back. Then we use, uh, we use this device and then we squeeze it like this so that it is small and it can cut through the bastana issue. And what is the importance? This we, one... We want to know. This one uh, contains progesterone and it will release it slowly by slowly. So when it releases the progesterone, it prevents the animals from releasing eggs, from cycling. So we pause the reproductive cycle and then when we come to remove it, then the cycle will continue. So we shall remove it from all the animals and the cycle will now move at the, at same, the time same time in all, all the animals. animals. Yeah. Yes. So that's how it is done. You make sure the viewers are able to see what is happening. These kind of technologies are uh, really supposed to be shown to the farmers. Those, those who are interested, we shall be giving them uh, that kind of Come here, make sure the viewers are seen. So it holds in place and it will be there until we hold on this and we can pull it out. If we can't, if we don't, then it will stay in place uh, for all that time. So that is how we insert the suppository. Then we we'll go to another animal and we shall do the same thing. So that is something very, um, that's something very interesting. And uh, we want to thank the team that yeah. is really, that is really, that is, that is bringing these uh, kind of technologies uh, all these are heifers. So this is very, very interesting. Our viewers out there, these are very, very important technologies that we need to improve our herd. And I've been back on the journey to make sure that this happens with a team of uh, very useful scientists. And we believe that together as a team, we are going to do quite a very, very, very wonderful job. And we're going to improve the livestock sector uh, um, together as a as a country <laughs>
and uh, with our, as us as farmers, we need to embrace. We need to embrace the the, the technology. <laughs> All these are heifers. So we are making sure so Those videos we are going to put in the box. We have a small TV. Nature to wake up. 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 Nature to